Alright, we're back for another Smash or Pass, and this time we are doing the Yu-Gi-Oh! Universe. Uh, so I'll be going through the original universe because I want to, it's my favorite series, and if you don't like it, you can suck it! So, here we go, this will be a quick one. First on our list, we got, um, first on our list is Mai. Mai Valentine, looking like a whole snack. She's always been a whole snack. I love her so much, very dearly. She can get it any day of the week. That voice, talented, and very, very smashable. So smash on Mai Valentine. Next up, we have the lovely and beautiful Taya. Always had a crush on Taya. Don't know why Yugi always, it's, Yugi was playing them games with Taya. But then again, Taya was, could make a reminder whether or not she liked Yugi or Yami. So both sides were playing the games. Personally, I think they should just, you know, go ahead and just do it already and get it out of the systems. But yeah, I smashed Taya. She was hot. She's always been hot. Yeah, smash on Taya. Next up, we have Shizune. Yes, Merrick's sister. Uh, I always found her to be hot. I liked her voice. Thought it was sexy. Quite frankly, I almost thought she was going to get with Kaiba at some point, but that was just me. But I always liked her. So yeah, uh, smash. Smash. Very uh, smashable. Next up, we have uh, Harpy Lady number two. I don't know what you're thinking. Goku, Goku, there's more Harpy Ladies. Well, I'm going with the most recognizable one, and that's Harpy Lady 2. She looked, she was always the one I was most interested in, and she looked like a whole snack. And I know I'm not the only one who has this way of thinking. So, I'm going with Harpy Lady number 2. Long story short, it's a smash. She's sexy. Love her. One of the best uh, monster cards out there. Probably the second most beautiful card you got out there. I could be wrong, because, you know, there's so many female cards out there, but, uh, she's the one that I think of only second to this last one that we're doing, which is, come on guys, you know what this whole video is gonna be about. You know what we're leading up to, it's Dark Magician Girl. How can it not be about Dark Magician Girl? I'm probably gonna put it in the thumbnail of this video anyway. It's Dark Magician Girl, the mo- she must be just the poster girl for sexy Yu-Gi-Oh monsters. I mean, come on, the moment she was revealed, everybody was going, was losing their minds. They were just foaming at the mouth. I know I was. And my favorite card is Dark Magician, so you had to know I was gonna love Dark Magician Girl. So long story short, she's a smash. She's the ultimate smash. And if you don't like it, you can kiss my ass. Because Dark Magician Girl is number one girl in Yu-Gi-Oh. I know I said that was gonna be the last one by breaking the rules a little bit, and I'm gonna give a little honorable mention to uh, Kiza from Yu-Gi-Oh! GX. I don't like Yu-Gi-Oh! GX, but personally, I always thought she was hot, and she's a smash. If you were wondering my thoughts on that. So, yeah. She's a smash. Really liked her character. Liked her design. Didn't care for the show that much, but she was hot, and I'd smash her. And that does it for this quick Smasher Pass video. If you enjoyed this video, hit that thumbs up, like, and subscribe if you want me to do more you know, a more in-depth version, where I have to go through multiple ones, including the GX version, then please give this a thumbs up and help me and my goal of reaching 100k. Alright guys, thank you for joining and I will see you all in the next video. Ta-ta and goodbye! We are heroes tonight.